Hi, Marin. Um, I've been watching all your videos since, like, the apologetic videos you made. I didn't see the ones before that, the one with Neela. But, yeah, I kind of got addicted to you. And I thought this getting to know you thing, well, I wanted to join, <laughs> if that's okay. So, and I was like, I don't have a pet peeve. What am I getting irritated about? Nothing. I'm a happy person. But then I realized the thing that makes me angry is people that don't expect other people to be able to handle things. And then they cover things up. So, and especially when people don't think of children like human beings. They're like, oh, I want to shield this person from the world. And what I'm thinking about is when pets die or get put to sleep. And people don't tell the children what have happened to their animals. And somehow they think that it makes it all better, that they don't know. And... I just want to say, it doesn't. It makes it worse. Because when you love an animal as much as a child can do, and suddenly it's not there anymore, and the grown-ups won't tell you wh where it went. They're like, obviously telling lies. And you're like, what really happened? And you start to, like, wonder, like, did it suffer? Is it dead? And you start imagining the worst. And just imagine if if you were to do that to a grown-up, it would not be accepted. <laughs> and it's crazy. And generally, I, I get so angry when people treat children like they're not like worth the same as other human beings. You know, it's just a child. No, it's not. It's a human being. You're a human being the second you get born. And you should be treated that way. You sh should be getting rights and you should be listened to. That gets me angry. <laughs> Doesn't that, don't, don't I seem angry? No, I don't. And right now, I'm, like, getting annoyed that when I try to speak in these videos that I do, the language gets in the way. So sometimes I just think, why don't I do a, uh, a video in Swedish and then, like, text it? But then I realize, no, that won't be even possible, because then I would... I, I would talk too fast and too much, and I would never have the energy to text all that. <laughs> so, let's just speak in English. Yeah. So, I won't be... I'll stop now, I think. <laughs> yeah. So, that was the thing that made me annoyed. And, to tell you the truth, I didn't even know what pet peeve was <laughs> because I was like, does it has to have to be something about pets? Now I understand it doesn't. <laughs> so yeah, so you can understand I am meditated about this language thing, but I think it will go away in time. So oh, and I'm irritated about people that is saying to me when I say I want to lose some weight, and I don't mean a lot of weight. I'm I mean, a couple of kilos. And they say, like, oh, you don't have to lose weight. You, you find the way you are. Yeah, I know. I am. But, I mean, what I'm eating when I gain weight is not healthy. 
and I'm not trying to lose weight to look good. I try to lose weight to be healthy. So there's a huge difference. Difference. And people can't understand that. They think the second someone says, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change what I eat because what I'm eating isn't good. They're like, don't get anorexia. I'm not going to get anorexia from eating healthy. That's just crazy. <laughs> So, and getting exercise is not going to kill me. What am I supposed to do? Sit at home and eat, like, cream all day? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, thank you for bringing the question up. I look forward for, to another question, because that would be fun. And take care. <laughs>